This is Shane Harper from Good Luck Charlie and God's Not Dead, and you're watching Dispatch Radio. Folks, we've been talking a lot about health lately, and we have a fitness expert on with us now. We're going to talk about UpriseWellness.com. It is um, a Pilates expert, and that's uh, Sheena, Sheena Youngen, Youngenel. How'd I do? Not too bad? Perfect. <laughs> She's a <laughs> part of uh, Pilates and Acupuncture, co-founder co and president. And I, I really want to get to, um, first, Sheena, go into a little bit of your background with Pilates. Like you, in your bio, what I, what I was reading here is they kind of really was a – really moved after you had some surgery done and the rehabilitative process really kind of inspired you to kind of move in this direction maybe more seriously? I was a dance major. I was getting a degree in dance in college. Uh, I injured my knee. I saw an orthopedic surgeon. He told me I had to have surgery and I was basically done with my dance career. Um, I refused to believe that and Someone had told me of Pilates, and back then, no one had heard of it. It was back in um, 93. So I started seeing a rehab for my knee, and within two weeks, I was back to normal. It was amazing. Um, so I kept going back to her, and my body changed tremendously. Uh, but it was phenomenal for rehab. I know one of the so things I that, that Pilates... I was going to say one of the things that Pilates supporters really talk about with this rehabilitative process is how, you know, you you elongate your spine, you really kind of develop sort of a natural posturing, things like that. Is that pretty much what you were finding was working for you and why your recovery went so quickly? Yes. I mean, Pilates said you're only as young as your spine is, your spine is flexible. So, which is true with Pilates, it's all about proper placement of your of the anatomy. So, elongating your spine and your posture and your body, and just getting your body back to realignment. So, it is very um, rehab as well. If you have any injuries, anyone can do Pilates. Hmm. Any age, young, the elderly, yes. How is it that the uh, inflammation and the the like the surgery that you went through how how is it that this type of exercise this type of regiment really helps your body when it comes to inflammation and healing you're working so the difference between when going to a physical therapist or going to Pilates for example a physical therapist will focus just on the injured site or the site that needs um, that was had surgery or needs the rehab Whereas in Pilates, you're working the whole body as you're still strengthening and working with that injured area. You're not neglecting the rest of the body. So the body works as a whole. So in Pilates, you're still going to work the entire system, not just the area that you had surgery on, which helps with healing. And so when you have an injury, let's say, you know, your, your right shoulder, then all of a sudden your, your, le your right hip is bothering you because you've been limping and if you had a cast on it, so you're rupture an Achilles tendon and you've been, you know, favoring the other side. So your whole body becomes out of whack. So with Pilates, you're working the entire system, the entire body and getting it back to alignment. We're talking with Sheena Yanganel about uh, the benefits of Pilates. And I really want to transition now into another aspect of uh, holistic medical care that she's definitely an endorser of, and that is acupuncture. And everybody, first off, let, let's try to first set aside some of the, the critics, uh, what, what are some of the things that are just totally the myths and wrong impressions about acupuncture? Um, quite frankly, I've heard so many positive things about acupuncture. When I when people hear that I, I do it, I, there's always a success story. I haven't encountered any um, myths or things that people have heard about acupuncture that are not positive. Um, at least I haven't. Um, I think maybe one of the things would be that everyone, maybe they automatically assume the practitioner is going to be Chinese. <laughs> um, <laughs> and they're a little surprised when um, it's not, it's not a Chinese. I'm not, I'm not Chinese, but um, they're, they're a little taken aback. Like, oh, you're you're a white girl. <laughs> so let's talk about the, the body's response to this. Acupuncture, you know, is a great medical tool, definitely for treatment, but also for preventative uh, measures and illness. And how does it really, you know, augment and really help, let's say, immune response and, and the recovery process? So what acupuncture does is bring the body back to homeostasis. 
So whatever is off, it's trying to bring your body back to homeostasis. Um, um, so there's each point has a therapeutic effect. Um, there's a point that works specifically for pain in the entire body. There's a point that works for the muscles and tendons in the body. And then you have more acute points, where, depending if you're working on orthopedic stuff, like neck pain or lower back pain, then you would needle more proximal. Um, and it ties in the internal organs as well. So um, everything has an it or an outer connection. You can find out a lot more of what Sheena's talking about in details at UpriseWellness.com. And what Sheena does here, and I really want to kind of transition quickly here into how she really takes these two aspects of therapeutic care and recovery into, into more holistic nature by combining Pilates and acupuncture as a, a great way to seek, you know, basically optimal health and fitness for all of her clients. So give everybody a little idea of, of your business structure and what successes that you're finding. The combination of Pilates and acupuncture are great. A lot of people come in wanting to do Pilates, but they have an injury. So the acupuncture helps alleviate some of the pain, some of the swelling, and then that gets them ready to be able to do Pilates. So it's a nice combination. And you're the only studio in L.A. that does this? I believe so, yes. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. Now, the, your notes, and I got a little bio note here that uh, ask about, what is the tower? I'm not quite sure I understand what the tower is. So we offer group tower classes. The tower is a piece of machine called the Cadillac. Um, so we have the reformer, the Cadillac. Someone just applied to trade his machines. He had the reformer and the Cadillac and a couple chairs. The Cadillac, is, the tower essentially is the Cadillac. It's attached to the wall so we can offer classes on the Cadillac. So it becomes the tower. And they're our most popular classes. It's a really good workout. It has all the springs. You can do uh, the it's an apparatus workout with leg springs, arm springs, push through bars. It's one of our toughest workouts that we offer. Obviously, we've talked mostly about just physical benefits at this point, Sheena. So let's transition a little bit about the mental aspects of this. How does Pilates and acupuncture really move towards a lot of improvement for psychological, physiological improvement, you know, just not beyond just the, the pure inflammation and those kinds of things, pain management, but more beyond like the psychological aspects of happy people, happy, relaxed people. It, people really feel so good after doing Pilates. And what, when you're actually doing Pilates, you're not thinking about your bills. You're not thinking about your stresses in life. You're so it's a very body and mind workout. So you're completely focused in your body, in the movement and what you're doing, and it just it feels so good. And just what Pilates said, it really works your brain. It works endorphins, the serotonin in your in your brain. So you just you feel happy and uplifted and rejuvenated after a workout. And I keep on just the same. I I feel like it's like going on vacation for an hour and just checking out. You're you're there. You're healing. You're relaxed. You fall asleep. There's music. It's tranquil. It's an escape that everyone. Fantastic do every day for an hour. I mean, it's, it's very hard to find the time to meditate. So this is a one hour where you can just lie down and heal and be calm. All right. We're going to link to uprisewellness.com, folks. You can find out a lot more information there. You probably should find a lot more opportunities to ask questions, find out information about uh, Pilates and acupuncture, and also reach out to Sheena and her team to, uh, you know, get involved, find uh, the location. It, it, maybe there's not a location you're not in L.A. If you're catching this online, possibly you're uh, in a different city. Maybe there's something that she can recommend or a place they recommend, or maybe you can just get information to ask about to your own doctor. And, you know, Sheena, I thank you so much for your time. We're really trying to make sure we get – you know, alternative uh, information to folks. I mean, again, today in 2015, we're, we're still on the treadmill of doing a lot of the same old practices. Mm -hmm. And you know, what you appear to be doing here really is to be very out of the box and with a lot of great results. And I, I thank you so much for sharing that with uh, our readers and our listeners. My pleasure. Thank you so much for having me. All right.